you're laying in bed and just trying to fall asleep. But your brain has other plans. It starts to replay the most embarrassing moments that ever happened to you. Today, years ago. Why does it happen? Why is our brain torturing us? What if I told you that it's not really torturing us? It's just trying to keep us safe. Yesterday, I went to have some coffee with my husband. He had to step outside, and I'm standing at the counter, placing an order. I got his order in, and as I'm about to say mine, the thing I get every time, my brain just goes completely blank. Nothing. Nothing at all. And I'm trying to think of coffee. At that point, really coffee. Really, just coffee, coffee. What kind of coffee do I know? And there's nothing. There's a menu board, and I can see it, but all of a sudden, it's just blurry. Gosh, I was so embarrassed. My face was all red. And it actually, it's a little red now, because as I'm telling you that story, ugh, I'm just reliving all of those emotions again. The worst part, there was a little line starting to form behind me. And then I just go, cappuccino, as if it was the meaning of my life that I remembered. Later that day, I find myself getting ready to go to bed. I'm brushing my teeth. And that moment just pops up all of a sudden. And then I'm laying in bed, I'm just trying to fall asleep. And that moment just goes on a loop. I'm thinking, gosh, brain, why are you do why are you even doing this to me? Turns out there is a little part in our brain called amygdala. And it handles emotional learning. When something stressful happens to you, like being in um, socially awkward situations, being embarrassed, your brain marks it as something important because all of the chemicals that got released. And then later when you're relaxed, your brain replays it just to kind of check in with you. It's kind of like asking you a question. Hey, did we learn something from it? Are we feeling safe? Because our brains are huge prediction machines and it's just trying to prepare you in case if something similar ever happens. So, your brain is not torturing you when it's replaying those moments. It's just trying to keep you safe. So I said, thank you brain for the message. I got the message, no more. Next time you find yourself replaying those moments, don't be too hard on yourself. Just thank your brain for trying to keep you safe. If you're feeling brave, I'd love to hear your little embarrassing stories in our uh, comments. And if not, that's okay too. Now, I'm not an expert. I'm just someone who loves to learn. And I hope that it helps you too. As always, thank you for watching. And I'll see you next time.